Okay, kids, we are going to learn about leopard today. Okay, so let's start about it. So, um, you can see this is a pig fat family and uh, they are mammals, belongs to the cat family. Similar characteristic to domestic cat, they par, stalk their prey and like guiding tree. And is also a very strong swimmer. So, appearance, we have to we just uh, have this, you know, special golden coat with black marking that are called rosette because they look very similar to rose. Uh, the rosettes are a form of camouflage. It helps their part to blend in the grass and trees where they live. Hiding in trees allows leopard to have a better view of their prey without being seen. And leopard have short, powerful legs and long tail that helps them to kind balance and swim they can run up to speed of 40 miles per hour now black leopard has spots but they are very hard to see can you see this is very very hard to see because the spots blend in the fur did you know male leopard can almost twice size of a female a leopard's tail can sometimes about the length at its body and leopard can hear five times more sounds than the human ear where they live they live in the central asia north east africa china and also india uh, leopards are species are adapted to different habitat and climate for example in desert can don't need much they don't need much water survive on the moisture they get from the eating their prey so savanna the long grass of savanna allow them their far to blend uh, so that they can creep up on their prey unnoticed rainforest leopard like to sleep in trees which gives a great view in their prey and mountains, steep mountains are no challenge for them because they are excellent climber and their long tail help them to balance. So diet, so they are carnivorous and eat varieties of animals such as antelope, baboon, deer, pigs, rats, birds, reptiles, insects, crabs and fish. So you but eat uh, even pet if opportunity arise. Now young, female leopard usually give birth to two cubs and cubs born in the gray, grayish fur and spots are not clearly visible. They born blind and weight around 500 gram. They open their eyes at around 10 days. So leopard cubs drinks their mother's milk and they do not leave their den until they are about three months old. When cubs are mastered the skill, they need to survive, they will move away. And they usually happens when they are around 12 to 18 months old. Leopard are solitary creature. They prefer to live alone rather than in a group. Endangered animal. Uh, they are now considered vulnerable animals. The means that population is declining. It could be danger of dying out. Leopard used to live in many places about the world, but habitat has reduced because of hunting and land development. That natural habitat developed for many use like farming, housing, and mining, so and also for roads. So you can think how can we save and, and increase our needs. Now, Amur leopard. Amur leopard is uh, found in Far East Russia and some part of northern China. Was rarest wild cat and classica, classified as critically endangered. Thought that there are only around eighty five of them lived in wild, uh, lived in wild. And Amur leopard has been killed for their fur. A national park has been opened in the far east of Russia to protect Amur leopard. Other names of them are far east leopard, Korean leopard. Manchurian leopard and then snow leopard that's so beautiful to see isn't it the grayish white snow leopard far allow them to blend easily in the snow and they can withstand low temperature can be found in mountain area such as eastern Himalaya snow leopard use their long tail to balance while climbing the steep slope and leap up to six times the length of their whole body they wrap their tail around their body to keep them warm snow leopard prey on sheep, goat from farming communities. Unlike other leopards, snow leopards are not aggressive towards human. It's very interesting, isn't it? So we can learn so many things about leopard today, isn't it? It is very interesting. So see some uh, videos of leopard and, uh, and you can also try to learn um, something about them, isn't it? Thank you for listening. We'll come with another topic next week. Bye-bye for today.